NEC, empowered by innovation. Welcome to NEC and DBS Analytics Encore Technology Suite Overview. This presentation will show you how Encore provides a 360-degree view of your contact center's interactions, including call recording, screen recording, quality management, and reports. In today's contact centers, the recorded voice is not enough. Businesses need to hear the conversations and see how the agent is using their software. Governmental laws and regulations dictate specific requirements for storage, retrieval, and controlled access to recorded conversations. Managers need to be able to search and retrieve recordings by various criteria beyond the phone and extension number. Examples include call result type, customer or patient ID, and support ticket number. Contact center managers are continually challenged with finding the time to coach agents for performance improvement. Businesses also need to be assured that coaching happens automatically and consistently. Encore's ability to view desktop activity while listening to recorded conversations provides a 360-degree view of customer interactions. Using this complete picture, Encore users are better equipped to leverage recordings to improve performance and business processes. Tools that come standard with Encore help you meet strict government laws and regulations, including built-in encryption, automatic archival, audit logs, and controlled permissions. Encore's eCapture feature collects additional data from desktop applications to help locate groups of recorded calls that may be related to a specific customer, patient service provided, call type, and more. Encore's eCoaching automatically sends assignments for online tutorials to agents when evaluation scores do not meet set thresholds. This ensures consistent coaching and training even when managers are too busy. Encore integrates voice recordings with desktop activity for maximum business intelligence to improve customer satisfaction and uncover agent challenges. To open Encore, browse to the URL address provided to you. Click the Login button and enter your username and password. Icons at the top of the window represent each working area within Encore. This includes the Home page, which reflects the current status of coaching assignments sent and received. The Recorded Contacts page, shown here, provides a view of all recordings in the system and unique libraries and playlists. The Analytics page, which provides various reporting tools. The Evaluations page, where evaluations, questions, and e-coaching modules are managed. And the Users and System Configuration page, where users, teams, groups, and system settings are configured. Encore uses libraries to store recordings. The system library includes all recordings available in the system. Permissions set by system administrators dictate if some or all recordings are viewable by a particular user. The public library is managed by the system administrator. Every user has access to this library and may see all recordings in it. The group library is managed by the group or system administrator who may copy recordings to it or delete recordings from it. Only users assigned to the group may view recordings in this library. The My Library is managed by you, and the group and system administrators may also copy recordings to it or delete recordings from it. You are the only user that may view recordings in this library. Playlists are predetermined queries that help you find and organize recordings quickly. There are two types of playlists, dynamic and static. Dynamic playlists help you quickly find recordings that match your search criteria. When you click the Refresh button, any new recording that matches the criteria is added to the playlist. Static playlists help you group and organize recordings that you want to view later. Playlists are also grouped into two main categories. Shared playlists contain playlists that may be viewed by either your group or by everyone. And My Playlists contain playlists that only you may access. To create a new playlist, right-click My Playlists click New, and then choose either Dynamic or Static. When you choose to create a new Dynamic Playlist, the Builder opens. The criteria available here is the same data shown in the columns on this page. Select criteria you would like to use to gather recordings in this playlist. To create a new Static Playlist, enter a name for the playlist, then click and drag recordings into it. The status bar shows the library where the recordings shown in the middle of the window originated the playlist of one was selected, and the number of recordings shown. The Encore interface may be customized for your use. For instance, you may move columns so they show in a different order. 
You may play, copy, comment, or perform other functions on a selected recording by clicking the buttons in the toolbar. They are also available when you right-click a recording. When you click the Play button, the player opens at the bottom of the window and plays the selected recording. The audio waveform shows on the right of the player. The gray bar on the waveform or player is the cursor and shows your current location in the recording. The screen recording is to the left of the player. To view it in a larger window, click the lower right corner of the screen recording. If multiple monitors are used, Encore records each one and shows them as thumbnails in the screen recording. Click a thumbnail to view it in the larger screen recording window. You may tag a recording to add a comment to a certain section of the recording. Encrypted audio is indicated by an orange line on the waveform. A user must have the correct permission assigned to his user account and the passphrase to listen to encrypted audio. Scrubbed audio is indicated by a gray line on the waveform. No user may ever listen to scrubbed audio. It is permanently erased from the recording. Wrap-up time shows as a green line on the waveform and only includes the screen recording to reflect the agent's desktop activities as he wraps up after the call is ended. From the recorded contacts page, you may also access a log of all activity that has occurred on a recording or an evaluation. For example, to view the activity that has occurred for a certain recording, select the recording and then click the down arrow on the right side of the window. Select Activity View. A list of evaluations that have been completed for the recording shows in the top portion of the window and a list of all system activity for the recording shows in the lower portion of the window. This feature is particularly helpful to our customers that must follow PCI or HIPAA regulatory standards. The Evaluations page shows all completed evaluations. Similar to the Recorded Contacts page, all evaluations are stored in the system library, and playlists can be created to gather evaluations for quick reference. New evaluations are created by clicking the Start Evaluation Session button or by right-clicking a recording on the Recorded Contacts page and choosing the Evaluate option. To view a current evaluation, select the evaluation and click the View Edit Evaluation button. The evaluation form opens. The top section of the evaluation shows the total score the agent earned for a question category, such as service standards. The total score for the evaluation is also shown. The questions on the scorecard may be assigned to different tabs to help the evaluator follow the typical flow of a call. Individual questions are shown in the body of each tab. A comment may be added to each individual question. And a comment may also be added as a general statement for the entire call. The audio and video or screen recording play at the bottom of the scorecard. Evaluation forms are also created on this page. Click the Form Builder button to create evaluation forms. Forms that you are working on are shown on the Forms under Construction tab, and forms that have been published and are currently in use are shown on the Published Forms tab. Questions that are included on the evaluation are added on the Questions tab. A library of 50 standard questions is included with Encore. E-coaching modules are also managed in the Form Builder. Click the eCoaching Modules tab to add new modules or edit existing modules. As recordings are evaluated, if an agent earns a score on a question below the specified threshold, an eCoaching module is automatically assigned to the agent. This helps to ensure that coaching occurs even if supervisors are not able to review evaluations on a particular day. For example, the questions earning a needs improvement score may trigger an eCoaching module, such as customer service guidelines, to be assigned to the agent. When the agent next logs into the system, the assignment list opens to show them all e-coaching modules they must complete. The Analytics page shows a list of approximately 40 reports available for you to review. Agent and team performance, sales results, audit information, and other data captured in Encore. Similar to the recorded contacts page, reports may be stored in various libraries and they may also be saved in Shared Reports or My Reports to run with standard criteria, such as running the Agent Performance Trending Report for a certain group of agents. To execute a report, select the report and then click the Select Report Criteria button. The Report Criteria window opens. Select the criteria for the report and click the Execute button. The report opens in a separate window.
The top portion of the report shows the agent's average score on the evaluation form, called Customer Care, for each month. The lower portion of the report shows the same data in a graph. The User and System Configuration page shows all users, teams, and groups set up in the system. Encore is designed to be administered by users, not technology specialists. Permissions, such as if a user can view screen recordings, evaluate recordings, listen to encrypted audio, and more, are based on the user's login account and are assigned to the individual user or the user's assigned group. Encore provides a comprehensive online help system. Simply click the Help button to open it. The online help provides explanations of all features, quick tips, report samples, and troubleshooting tips. To summarize, DBS Analytics Encore records both the voice and desktop activities, providing a 360-degree view of your contact center interactions. As an all-inclusive software package, Encore provides recording, compliance tools, quality management features, analytics, and system configuration in a single software application. With its ability to capture additional data, Encore helps you analyze your contact center interactions with more detail than ever before. Encore's e-coaching modules are automatically assigned to agents, providing peace of mind that agents receive immediate coaching attention when it is needed most. This concludes DBS Analytics Encore Overview. If you would like more information, please email us at necfocus at necam.com. We will be happy to schedule a live demo and answer any of your questions. NEC, empowered by innovation.